Hello, and welcome to Asian Odyssey. If you're a fan of futuristic tales and high-tech adventures, you're in the right place. Today, we're blasting off into the universe of Korean sci-fi movies. From mind-bending time travel to futuristic dystopias, these 10 films are sure to ignite your imagination. Let's get started on this cinematic journey. Number 10, Seo Bok. Seo Bok is a 2021 sci-fi action film directed by Lee yong Ju. The story follows Ki Hyun, a former intelligence agent who is suffering from a terminal illness. He is tasked with safely transporting Seo Bok, a human clone created through stem cell cloning and genetic engineering. Seo Bok holds the secret to immortality, making him a target for various powerful forces seeking to exploit his abilities. As Ki Hyun and Seo Bok navigate dangerous situations, they form an unexpected bond. Along the way, they confront ethical dilemmas and the pursuit of eternal life. While Seo Bok begins to question the purpose of his existence. The narrative is engaging but unfolds at a deliberate pace. Director Lee yong Ju expertly balances the film's sci-fi elements with its emotional core, while Gong Yu and Park Bogum deliver powerful performances that anchor the film's exploration of humanity and ethics. This film has 6.1 rating on IMDb. Number 9, Lucid Dream. It is a 2017 sci-fi thriller film written and directed by Kim Joon Sung. The movie centers around Dae Ho, an investigative journalist whose son was abducted three years ago. Desperate to find him, Dae Ho turns to a new form of therapy that allows him to relive his memories through lucid dreaming. With the help of his psychiatrist friend and a detective, Dae Ho dives into his dreams to revisit the events of the day his son disappeared. As he navigates his subconscious, he uncovers mysterious revelations that hold the key to the truth. The film explores themes of memory, grief, and the blurred lines between dreams and reality. Its sci-fi elements are reminiscent of Inception, but with a unique Korean twist that adds depth to the genre. The cast delivers strong performances, with Gosu portraying the desperate father with emotional depth and conviction. It has 6.1 rating on IMDb and is available on Netflix. Number 8, Badland Hunters. It is a 2024 sci-fi action film directed by Heo Myung Hang in his directorial debut. This movie is a standalone sequel to 2023 film Concrete Utopia. The movie is set in a dystopian future where a massive earthquake has turned Seoul into a lawless badland. The plot follows Nam San, a relentless wasteland hunter who hunts the animals to sell their meat. He shares a special bond with an 18-year-old girl who reminds him of his late daughter. But she abducted by a mad doctor who conducts horrific experiments on teenagers resulting in many deaths. Nam San, along with his friend and a military sergeant, embarks on a perilous mission to rescue the girl. Badland Hunters offers a gritty, post-apocalyptic vision of Seoul, blending sci-fi elements with intense action and survival themes. Ma dong Seok shines as the tough, resilient hunter, delivering a performance that is both powerful and nuanced. This film has 5.9 rating on IMDb and is available on Netflix. Number 7, The Moon. It is a 2023 sci-fi adventure movie directed by Kim Yong-hwa. The story follows the harrowing journey of Huang Sun Wu, an astronaut stranded on the moon after a disastrous space mission. Set in the near future, the film depicts South Korea's first manned mission to the moon, which ends in tragedy due to an explosion on board. Five years later, a second mission is launched but suffers a catastrophic malfunction, leaving astronaut Sun Wu stranded in space. As his oxygen levels deplete and communication with Earth is lost, Sun Wu's only hope lies with former Space Center director Kim Jae Gook, who leads a daring rescue operation to save him. The film alternates between the tense survival struggle on the moon and the desperate efforts on Earth to bring Sun Wu home, exploring themes of isolation, human resilience, and the unwavering pursuit of hope against impossible odds. The film has 5.9 rating on IMDb. Number 6. Project Wolf Hunting. It is a 2022 science fiction action movie directed by Kim Hong Sun. The film is set on a cargo ship transporting dangerous criminals from Manila to Busan. During the voyage, the prisoners stage a coordinated escape attempt, leading to a brutal riot. Amidst the chaos, a superhuman entity known as Alpha, created through sinister experiments, is unleashed. As the criminals and law enforcement clash, Alpha's rampage turns the ship into a floating nightmare. Project Wolf Hunting pushes the sci-fi genre into dark, gritty territory, combining high-concept genetic experimentation with brutal horror, creating a unique and visceral experience. Seo in Gook delivers a powerful performance as the unrepentant serial killer. This movie has a 6 rating on IMDb. Number 5, Flu. 
It is a 2013 sci-fi thriller film written and directed by Kim Sung Soo. The story centers around a deadly outbreak of a highly contagious and lethal virus near Seoul. The virus causes severe flu-like symptoms and kills its victims within 36 hours. As the virus spreads uncontrollably, the city plunges into chaos, putting immense pressure on emergency services and government officials. The film follows Dr. Kim in hai an infectious disease specialist, who teams up with a dedicated team to race against time in finding a cure and containing the epidemic. This film features effective cinematography that vividly portrays the outbreak's spread and the city's descent into chaos, with gritty realism that heightens the film's impact. The film has a 6.6 .6 rating on IMDb. Number 4. Alienoid it is a 2020 sci-fi action film directed by Choi Dong-hoon. The film intertwines two timelines, the late Goryeo dynasty and the present day. In the past, Taoist wizards search for a mystical sword, while in the present, aliens have been imprisoning their criminals in human bodies on Earth. The story follows Guard, a stoic alien, and his robot companion Thunder, as they try to stop an evil alien known as the Collector from freeing his fellow prisoners. Their mission leads them to cross paths with various characters, including a bounty-hunting magician and a mysterious woman named Lee On. The sequel, Alien Return to the Future continues the saga of humans and aliens across different timelines. The film's ambitious mix of futuristic technology and ancient magic sets it apart in the sci-fi genre. The plot is complex and fast-paced with numerous twists and turns that keep viewers engaged. The film Alienoid holds a 6.2 rating on IMDb, while its sequel has a slightly higher rating of 6.6. Number 3. Wonderland it is a 2024 sci-fi romance movie that explores a virtual world where people can reunite with their loved ones through artificial intelligence. The film follows several interconnected stories of individuals who use this simulated world called Wonderland to reconnect with those they've lost. Among them are a woman who reunites with her late husband, a flight attendant who interacts with his comatose boyfriend, and an ill woman who wishes to stay connected with her daughter even after her death. The film's exploration of life's impermanence and humanity's desire to preserve love beyond death is visually compelling. Tang Wei, Bei Suzy, and Park Bo Gum deliver solid performances, infusing their characters with depth and emotion. Wonderland has a 6.2 rating on IMDb and is available on Netflix. Number 2. The Host it is a 2006 sci-fi horror film directed by Bong Joon-ho. The story begins when an American military pathologist orders the dumping of toxic chemicals into Seoul's Han River, resulting in the creation of a monstrous creature. Years later, the creature emerges from the river and attacks people on the bank. It abducts a young girl and takes her to its hiding place. With no help from the Korean authorities, her bumbling family decides to lead a rescue effort on their own. The host combines intense monster action with a heartfelt family drama. The story turns suddenly from horror to pathos to comedy to action and back again. Right from the beginning, this movie is interesting, and once it hook you, it never lets go. The film holds a 7.1 rating on IMDb. Number 1. Call it is a 2020 sci-fi thriller film directed by Lee Chung-hyun and based on the 2011 British film, The Caller. The story revolves around two women living in different eras who become entangled through a mysterious phone call that transcends time. The protagonist, living in the present day, discovers an old phone in her childhood home and begins receiving calls from an anonymous person named Young Suk. But surprisingly, she is 20 years behind from the present time and lived in the same house. As they bond over their shared experiences, they soon realize that their interactions have unforeseen consequences on their present and future lives. The film features several frames where past incidents impact the present, beautifully narrated with subtle VFX and brilliant camera work. The performances by Park Shin Hai and John Jong Seo are captivating, effectively conveying the emotional depth and psychological turmoil of their characters. If you enjoy thriller movies with a touch of science fiction, The Call might be worth checking out. It has a 7.1 rating on IMDb and is available on Netflix. And that's a wrap on our list of the top 10 Korean sci-fi movies. We hope you found some new favorites to add to your watch list. Be sure to hit the like button and subscribe for more exciting content. See you next time! If you want to watch more videos like this, please don't forget to subscribe our channel.